What are we doing today? What are we doing today? <laughs> All right, guys. So let's do a little time frame first. We are currently the second week of April. Um, winter is finally over. over. Knock on wood. Yeah. Um, we have had a few nice days, and we got out here, and we did some fairing for with the total fair. Uh, we, we tried this compound. It seems to be working a lot better um, as far as, like, not sagging and stuff um it has its pros and cons again um i think we did another video on that and today we have a pretty decent day we're right around 60 degrees um we are going to continue fairing uh it's kind of been kicking our butts a little bit trying to get everything fair uh what i did is i made a couple of long scrapers and you'll see us using it here in a, in a few minutes i'm sure and uh what we're gonna do is we're just gonna get it on there and i'm gonna take the long scraper and just kind of do a wide swoop over the whole thing and that really should fill the low spots for us and hopefully you know kind of alleviate some of the headaches we've been having trying to do like light passes we'll just kind of get it on there and we'll deal with it from there um there shouldn't be too much sanding seeing as it's going to be a straight as i'm using um we hope we hope you know whatever i'm going to sand it either way so at this point it don't matter i just kind of want to get it fair and painted so we can get it flipped this is going to be the fourth coat on this um, side fourth coat but we haven't done like full coats full coats we've done like we did the seams the last time um we're, we're still staying about six inches up from the bottom uh where the gunnels go uh because we will have to fiberglass this all all as we flip the boat the gunnels get fiberglassed onto the outside um but yeah so that's kind of where we stand um today we're gonna do some fairing because we need to get re-motivated here to uh get going on this we've been working on our other boat trying to get that in the water and stuff too so we're using total fair yep um if you go uh, to totalboat.com use our code for 10 percent off F 15 wait to the 10 or 15 i forget oh my god yeah it's, it's been, been a, a while it's been a little while sorry total boat um we'll use our code at checkout and you'll get i, I believe it's 10 percent off one time use code um yeah cassie will put the link in the description below yep All right, so we just swept everything down, um, got all the dust off, wiped everything down with the acetone that we're gonna work on today. Uh, we're basically focusing on all the straight spots, uh, pretty much from where all the pieces curve into the bow back. Um, so we're gonna work on all that. I've made these long straight edges, uh, putty knives, whatever you wanna call them, spreaders, uh, just a piece of metal. Uh, I took a piece of wood on the side and I just screwed it into the back and that just gives me something to hold and it also keeps it straight, it keeps it from flexing too much. So that's kind of the plan. Um, this one I believe is a 42 and the other one was a 36. Uh, I'm going to start with the longer one, try it and see how it goes. Um, if it's too much I'll grab the shorter one and go with that. Um, yeah, so we're all clean now. We're just about ready to get going. Um, Cassie's going to start mixing. We're going to do one side of the tunnel. And then we're going to jump off only because it's kind of hard to do the second side without leaning in what you did in the first place. So we're going to give it some time to dry and hopefully we can get back out here late this afternoon or tomorrow. So it's not got the other side. So. And that's it. And that's it. And hopefully this goes smoothly. Literally. Literally. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching, guys. Sorry for this terrible zoom in, but I had to crop it because I just don't have time to go frame by frame to edit out Carl's plumber's crack. So you're stuck with this zoom and crop.
So we just finished uh, half of the starboard hull here. Uh, I did up to the curve. Everything from the curve forward looks fairly good. I just got to touch it up a little bit. Um, we put quite a bit on. I used the straight edge. Um, the easiest method for me seemed to be to lay it on and kind of like glob it on. I marked some spots before I started and then take the straight edge and just pull it up and that gave us a pretty uh, a pretty smooth uh, surface there so um, after that I just hit it real quick with the plastic putty knife just to like knock any high spots down but uh, I think we look really good com compared to where we were um, I'll give this a sanding hopefully this week sometime um, and we'll kind of go from there uh, it seems to be working out so far uh, you know, any tips or suggestions from people that, that have done this before I mean, by all means um, you know it's definitely a new world to us so Action. All right, guys. So we just finished up the would be the starboard hall um, here. All the total. No, it's a starboard. I think. I don't know. Cassie says it's the oh, port. It. No, it's starboard. You're right. Yeah, flip it end over end, and it's starboard. Yeah. Alright, so 